Maury Amsterdam was one of the most fun people uh, in this business that I've ever been around. This was in 1970, and uh, he had purchased the rights to the old radio show, uh, popular on radio for years in the mid-40s. Can you top this? People would send in jokes, and comedians would uh, try to tell a joke and in the same category as the home viewer joke, you know, and try to top mm -hmm. it by an applause meter. Right. So it's old fashioned, you know, but, but simplistic and although simplistic, wonderfully original at the same time, if I may. But uh, through his, uh, his agents, I got a call to uh, host Can You Top This? Uh, and I remember that Soupy Sales was one of the regulars on the show as, as comics. And uh, Richard Dawson uh, would tell the home viewer joke. And then Maury Amsterdam's panel of celebrity friends, usually comics, would get up and uh, try to top the home viewer joke from a joke in the same category. Mm -hmm. and it, was just, it was just a fun show. And nobody did this better than Maury, I guess because it was, it was a favorite of his on radio, and thus he ended up buying the show. And um, it, was, uh, it was just terrific. We had, again, I had the opportunity to work with some terrific celebrities from Danny Thomas to, uh, uh, oh, you name it, Jack Benny was on the wow. show. Uh, anybody who was anybody in the world of comedy, uh, Maury Amsterdam could get them because they were all friends, you know. So it was just, it's really one of those shows that not only was, was, uh, was, was fun to be a part of, but it was especially fun to host because of the interaction that I had between myself and Richard Dawson and and Maury and all the rest of the comedians. Yeah. Good show, good show.